Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum and greetings. Ali Shama here with the H106 mini speedboat. Well, I'm missing the kids at the moment. I believe uh, Hadi should do the maiden, but uh, both of the kids are at school. And uh, this weekend, I mean, weekend is just right next to the corner. And this weekend, we can have lots of fun. So I brought this boat here to test it, to tune it, and then kids can have fun with it. So today, I'm going to do maiden for this boat and see how it goes and see how it performs. And at the same time, I do have my backup boat right there. Just in case something goes wrong, I will have something to save this boat. All right, let's get to action. Okay, got my radio. Battery is inside. So, let's just set it up. Ah, there, there's this pink uh, <laughs> ceiling <laughs> cover. <laughs> pink, I don't know. Why did they choose pink? Right, I believe I haven't used this battery and it is fully charged. So here we go. Power on. Pink cover ah, back on. And then the top cover on. All right, power it on. So far, nothing. No control signals, no uh, boat signals. So, first let me put it in the water and we will have both. Okay, we have lots of uh, algae here. Algae, algae, no algae. So, here we go. Boat, have fun. Okay, it turns on. I got control, yes. Rudder is working. And here goes the boat. Oh, it is a little faster, man. The left turn is good, but the right turn is not very good. So that's the full throttle. Well, not bad. Kids can have fun still. Oh, look at the turn, man. That is some serious turn here. I have to set the trims. Sweet, man. One moment. Trims, left trim, uh, throttle trim, uh, steering trim. Oh, hit the rock. Okay, very good. Now we are tracking straight. Almost. Much better. No, still going right. Much better. Now we are going left all the time. So trimming right. Doing very well. Man, I love the turns on this. Check it out. Woo! <laughs> What fun it is, man! I mean, boating is fun. Seeing that how much fun these boats are, I'm thinking that we should really go into DIY 3D printed boats. Now, that is some sweet idea. DIY 3D printed or any kind of DIY boats with uh, spare parts laying around in your house. So it will become a challenge that you 3D print or find whatever laying around in RC junk and make a boat and bring it down for a boat war. Now that sounds like a cool idea. I gotta get my friends in this too. That's gonna be a sweet video series. Anyway, let's drive more. Go! Does it go backward? Oh, yes, it goes backward too. <laughs> I drank some water. The boat threw a drop of water right in my mouth. <laughs> I don't want this water go in my mouth I'm trying to flip it and say if it flips can it come back to level or not let's try reverse anyway oh oh 
Oh, it goes reverse as well. <laughs> it's going underwater. <laughs> I just love this sound. It makes me crack every time I hear it. <laughs> Ooh, look at shoot. It's a nice boat, man. Hadi is going to have some serious fun. Inshallah. The range seems to be quite good on this, actually. It's not running out of power either. Oh, we went underwater. <laughs> it turned into submarine. <laughs> I'm not much worried. We have dual layers of sealing, I believe. At least one layer of pink cover that is sealed. All right, one moment. I want to say, how does it flip back? Uh, there is no button here that says flip back back feature um, so uh, let's let's just let's just try it for instance the boat is upside down okay no no yes yes it did work it did work, so you have to actually mash the throttle up and down. So here it goes again. Oh, whoa, it just flips back. I, I think it's something to do with its shape as well. See? Uh oh, now we have no control left. Oh, control gone back. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit, no control. Okay, upside down. So all you need to do is flip the throttle up and down. There you go. Awesome, man. This is superb! So we didn't need any rescue boat for this one. This is the rescue boat, actually. I can 3D print some kind of arm or claw and, you know, just install it on this boat and it will become our, you know, rescue boat. Sweet. Let me just throw it once again upside down. I'm just loving to do this. Oh man, nice! And that 7.4 volt lie ion battery seems to be doing really nice job. Man, this is one fun boat. Really fun boat. Now I'm losing speed, so battery is probably dying. I am just cracking or reshaping the prop. I'm just holding full throttles, want to see how long the battery will survive and what would happen to the motor in terms of heat. It's slowing down. All right, let's not tease the baby. Let's see how the waterproofing worked. Wash it a little bit. Water dropping. Not a problem. All right, let us see how much water is inside. So, here comes the first cover. That is water. Let it go. And let's see, pink cover. How much did you ah, protect our beautiful guts inside this little boat? Wow, man, look at the dryness inside. It's dry, it's dry like UAE deserts. Wow, nice. Warm battery. Woo. Motor is nice and 
working temperature. I mean, it's just a slightly warm. Sweet. Now that's what is a good, good working components in there, man. All right. Okay. Enough for this. Uh, sorry, the pink cover. That was a fun session with this boat. And next step. And next, of course, Hadi is gonna drive that. Arish is gonna drive that. And both of the kids are gonna have, inshallah, lots of fun racing these boats. And Baba will be filming. Thank you very much for watching. And if you're looking for a neat little fun boat, H106 here. A boat that you won't worry about flipping upside down. <laughs> oh! Oh, I, I become a submarine! I'm coming! I'm coming to catch you! He's going to catch you! Oh, I almost missed him! See, now you're driving like a snake again, but you're doing it! <laughs> at the water inside this Volantex boat. <laughs> All right, rescue, rescue. Very good. Whoa. Okay, this boat is coming. Time to rescue that boat. We are right here. <laughs>